depends on that umpire behind the plate. Will he give you that inside corner? Now a leadoff walk in the fourth. One and two. Chop and Lamb can't catch it. And Cano chops one into left field for a single, first and second. Good bunt. Warno turns and throws to Casilla. One away. Duncan and Cano move up. One strike to Cabrera. And a liner that'll tie the game. Gomez cuts it off, and Cabrera will hold up with a two run single. And it's four apiece. Runner goes. They've got him picked off. Morno with the throw. Got him. Popped up right field. And Kadir in his tracks almost. Catches the third out. A walk, a single, a big two run single by Cabrera. And a tie game going to the bottom of the fourth. <laughs> Lamb to center. Jeter makes another nice play to deny him another hit. Boy, he kept coming in and in on Mike Lamb. And it's nine batters. And a line drive caught by Rodriguez. Offensive lineup behind him. Shattered bat and a dribbler to second. Cano over to Duncan and the Twins are done in the fourth on to the fifth in a tie game. And Abreu's on base again. And another pitch up that Abreu just that smooth swing. Abreu goes blasted to center. Gomez back. He won't get there. Bounces hard off the wall. Fumbled once. Abreu's being waved around. The throw to second base. Not in time. And Rodriguez has put the Yankees in front. A scalding line drive to straightaway center field. Boy, he didn't miss that pitch right there. He fouled off some pretty good pitches from Perkins. And now Giambi with runners at first and third. Still nobody out. Well, the numbers on Brian Bass. One and one on the year. He last pitched on Saturday against the Tigers one and a third innings was roughed up for seven runs in hitters oh, Brian Bass coming out of the bullpen making his 16th appearance and the first pitch hammered in the right field and Rodriguez held up at third Bass with a great catch between his legs Rodriguez tagged out for the first out, I think he caught that ball between his legs. Two to Betamit. Called third strike out number two. Didn't help him. Morno gets the ground ball. Bass covers and a fine job by Brian Bass. The Yankees get one, but it could have been a much rougher inning for the Twins and Glenn Perkins. Pop up down the left field line. Mitsui crossing the line, making a nice running catch. One down. And let's go find Telly Hughes in the Minnesota Lottery winner circle. He's never won 20, but he's won 19 twice. High fly to deep center. Cabrera going back for the catch out number two. To left, his first hit of the ball game, and that'll get Kadir to the plate with two on or two out and one on. Driven get to out center. of here. <laughs> that ball is caught in center field by Cabrera. Kadir hit it on the button, but not enough loft. Here's and kept the Yankees with a one-run lead and another leadoff hit for New York. Molina. With a leadoff single here in the sixth inning. Different hitters, and that's been like that a long time. That's why the Twins' dugout is yelling at the home plate umpire. Casilla with a quick release after the catch, and they double off Molina. 
two and two to Jeter. And Bass strikes him out and faces just three men in the top of the sixth. Here, Twins haven't had a scoring threat really since the first inning. Curve and Kubel watches it for strike three. Sitting up here and watching these umpires nowadays, I think the strike zone has really gotten smaller. High fly ball left field. And Matsui with the catch. Young quickly retired. Now Jerry Meals is behind the plate here tonight. I think, uh, you know, Jerry Meals may have never been behind a plate from Mucina before. Lamb with a high fly to right. And Abreu waits. And Messina completes six innings. And he does so with the lead. Alex Rodriguez will bat second when the Yankees hit in the seventh.